In this video, we'll look at whether CuBr2, that's copper 2 bromide, is soluble or insoluble in water. And the short answer is that it's soluble in water. And we can use the solubility rules to figure that out. So if we have our solubility rules. This is a brief set of the solubility rules. We go down and we see that Br minus. In general, we have something like copper 2 bromide. We have this bromide ion here. Those are soluble with a few exceptions but copper is not an exception. So we expect CuBr2 to be soluble in water. When we look at this Br that has a minus, we have two of them. So this has to be two plus. So that's why we're calling it copper two. And when we put this copper two bromide in water, it's gonna dissolve. It breaks apart or dissociates into its ions. We'll have Cu2 plus ions, which will be aqueous, and then Br minus ions. Those will be aqueous too. And for every one Cu2 plus, we'll have two of the bromide ions. So in answer to our question, copper two bromide, CuBr2, is soluble in water. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.